Hey, Kevin, what do you have there? Well, this is my plasma cutter torch off of my AHP Alpha Cut. And, you know, sometimes things break and you got to fix them. And what happened was I was using it and it didn't want to light. You know, I pull in the trigger, nothing happened, nothing happened, nothing happened. The little contour, the little tip inside there was worn out. So it's just time to change it. it. Happens. You know, you use them, they wear out. I took the cap off of it, unscrewed that, and I went to unscrew the tip out of the end of the gun. And what happened was the tip snapped off. The threads snapped off down inside the hole. Can't get them out. So I got to change it. So I already got the six screws out that hold the two halves of the gun together. So what we have inside here is, here's the end of the the gun, you know, here's where the tip screws in. This is where the air comes out, the high pressure air that then swirls out and cause, you know, makes part of the arc. Uh, we have a control where we have an electrical line here. This is the power coming in from the plasma cutter. This is the air line right here. And then we have one more wire that goes into this little white sleeve that you see right here. Well, let's get that puppy out of there and see how we take it apart. Okay, so a little Allen wrench. So one thing we got to do is get rid of this little spot tie right here. And we need to cut this um, shrink wrap. It's on around this connector is right there. So we just need to cut that shrink wrap real quick so we can get that connector apart. Just need to peel that shrink wrap off. Well, we get him apart. And now I just need to open up that airline right there and opening those up a little bit. And now that the clamp's out of the way, it's held on there pretty tight. So I can come back with my razor knife and just slice that a little bit right there. Ah. Don't forget to save the clamp. We're going to need that on the other one. <laughs> Oops, took it off the wrong end. So let's open this clamp up. So I can just take my clamp, put my clamp back on the airline. Fit that back together. And I'm sure there's a special tool to do this job with. But what I found works pretty darn well is just a pair of wire cutters. And don't get too crazy with it. And just give it a little squeeze. Give it a little squeeze. Nice and tight. So let's start putting it back together. Now I don't have any heat shrink to go on here, like what I cut off. But I do have some electrical tape. Don't forget the electrical connection. Okay, so we got the head in there, we've got the airline hooked up down in here, got the power line hooked up, got this turned over and set down inside its little cradle the way it belongs. Because if you look over here on the other half of the plastic handle, you see there's a little tab right there that sticks up. And that little tab comes down and fits right in that hole and helps hold this in place so it's not moving around. So get this electrical line out of the way, get it over in here where, where it belongs. Got my trigger line, or my, my safety line rather, up out of the way. Got my safety, tri my trigger safety down in its little hole. So everybody should just kind of fall together now. Okay, and then just grab all the screws and get to screwing. Wait, what? Oh, baby. <laughs> Steady. And it's always smart to remember, you're just dealing with plastic here. So you've got metal screws and a plastic housing, so 
You don't need your Gorilla Grip. Okay. We can take our new tip, just thread that in by hand. A wrench on it, just give it just a little bit of a snug. You don't have to crank it down. Put swirl ring back on. Put my nozzle back on. And there you have it. And then just to make sure I know what I'm talking about and what I'm doing, <laughs> let's go ahead and cut a little piece of eighth inch steel and see what happens. So yeah, this is all fixed. That machine's now running. I can clean this up, get myself back to work. So hopefully that might help calm you down a little bit. You know, if you're having a problem like this, you know, oh geez, I broke something. You know, now I gotta go get a whole new cable, a whole new gun. No, nah. no, run out to George's Plasma Cutter shop. It's online, just Google George's Plasma Cutter and he can help get you the right part for it. He sells stuff on eBay. Great man, very, very knowledgeable. He'll set you, you know, he'll point you in the right direction, help save you some money. And don't forget to pop out to Patreon. Hopefully you'll sponsor me. That helps pay for some of the videos here, helps me make more better videos. So I'll see you guys next week. Shrink wrap, shrink wrap. Got little tiny ones, got great big ones, got even bigger ones. Electrical tape it is. <laughs>